Well, it's actually up when you finally sat down, you asked to play Apex Legends and then it doesn't work because the internet connection is up. Today, I'm gonna give you tips and tricks on how to fix this. Make sure you stick to the end of the video because I'm gonna give you an ultimate tip. First, we start with like the basic shit. Number one, restart your router. Always first start with restarting your router. Number two, check your internet connection. But I'm saying this because yes, I have to say it. Number three is use wired connection. Yeah, but my internet connection over Wi-Fi is perfect. You're not talking about your marriage here. You're talking about internet connection. So it's not perfect. Better use a wired connection. It's better than Wi-Fi. Simple as that. When you go in the game, you go to Frankfurt, you go to London, you go whatever. Try to go to a, a, another server, like the second nearest one. It works sometimes. Now, this game has actually been having this server lag, that it's the whole game would actually start to lag. Close the actual game, then start again, it's gonna throw you back to the exact same game. And from there, it normally works. So with this server lag, when you start to like move forward, but then you take two steps back, and then you move forward, and then you two, take two steps back, sounds like your life basically. So when this happens, restart the game. Some countries like Africa, Asia, dictatorship countries, they normally don't have a really good internet. I would highly recommend them to use a VPN. There's a lot of VPNs that is actually for free. I'm gonna make another tutorial for dummies talking about how to show the ping and the connection and the errors up to the right. But if you know, just it helps if you show it up to the right, because when you do that, you could see if the ping is actually varying. For Apex Legends, please, when you throw down an update just because you fucked up in your programming, let us know a couple of hours before it. Why don't you allow us to just pre-download the update and then update it its own like you do with the seasons? Can we all decide all together to subscribe to my channel and also send an email to Apex Legends? Please pre-inform us before we kick out your updates. Thank you very much. It's as simple as that. And the most important tip, apparently PlayStation requires a default setting of 888-884-4 as a DNS. Can't we just all sit down, write an angry email to Apex Legends like please inform us before you come home with friends? If you hit that subscribe button, I'ma hate you back. Just touch it gently.